Yo, what's good everybody? I am back again with another video. And I wanted to show off how to get steals with Shay Gilgis Alexander. So here's the thing. Everyone's complaining. 50 steals, no defensive badges being able to put on. I think you can put badges on them now, but I don't I don't need them now. I'm at the end. So I just got 10 steals last game. And I wanted to show you this method of how to get the steals. So I should have this finished. I should at least get five steals this next game. I need seven. Let's see if I can get it. What you need to do, here's what you got to do. You go to the challenges, play spotlight challenge around the world, Lithuania three. That's the one you want. Here's the thing. You're going to go up against the Sabonis father-son combo in Ogalskis, all big men. So when you play triple threat what happens is the pg is the one that gets the ball and he always wants to bring the ball to the court and that is sabonis who's a sapphire card so what i did was have shay out here and shay is going to be my shortest player he doesn't have to be uh he can be another guard out there with him, but he has to be the shortest player on your team to play the point guard position. That's how triple threat works. You're going to have him at point guard for you, which is your X icon when you play. And it's this simple. You just go in and play the game. It's my last agenda tracker, and I'm chilling for a minute. All you got to do, go up. Still, he can't dribble. He cannot dribble. It's that simple. You literally can just sit here and spam square on Sabonis who can't dribble. And eventually you get a steal every now and then. You, you can't foul out. So you can just sit here and spam it. What you want to make sure you do is score. If you do score, what's going to happen is he's got to take the ball out. And if they take the ball out, you get a chance to set it up and go up here and rip them just that easy. That easy. He can't hang with you because he doesn't have the ball handling and you have the steal rating. So you're not always going to get it every play, but it is so quick. I always make sure I score. Like I say, if you score, you're going to be in a better spot because he's got to take the ball out and you can set up and get the steal. You're going to get a foul call on you every now and then, but hey, this method has been money for me. So even if he gets it, another way is if he gets it and he goes to the rim, you can strip him like that and get steals half the time. That's one of the most easiest ways to get steals in 2K is by when they drive. And it's usually when they're going for the dunk. If they're going for the dunk and you're on their hip or behind them, you can probably get a pluck. And it's just that. You can get plucks online like that. Still, just like that. Just come up, spam it. You're going to get it. And since it's on pro difficulty, super easy. Still, just like that. I mean, now he's got to take over. His defense is going to be even better. Still, just like that. You want your Shea steals? This is the method. Still, just like that. You want to go into the ball hand and just rip them. I think I've already got my seven steals that I need. Box score says it. I got my seven steals. I'm done with my Shea Gilgis Alexander. I don't have to use this card again if I don't want to. That is wild. Eight steals. It's that easy. You want Shea steals, you want to come do this. Done. So guys, if you can, make sure you drop that like subscribe if you're new to the channel because i can drop more tips and things like that we're on the road to blake griffin that's what we want we want pink diamond blake griffin and we're on the road to trying to get him so guys make sure you follow the um the youtube follow the facebook that's where we stream it every day links in the description on the facebook if you want to hop in the stream we get our grind in um so yeah i'm done i, I I'm, I, I'm done with shay